What is up guys? Welcome back to another AMC video. We have lots to talk about today, especially how this week is the most important week ever for the AMC holders. Because this week, it could be a massive make or break. And the reason why, I'm about to explain it, and it's pretty spicy, and it's pretty interesting, and everyone needs to hear this, especially you got like the gamma squeeze, the short squeeze, the options, we all need to know this. Before we dive any deeper to the video, definitely check out the private Discord server, guys. Please, link in the description below. It's free until July 1st. Amazing profits for the first week of June, $10,000, and we always post every single trade. All the trades are over here. We even have an AMC, GME, and BlackBerry you know, section. And you can get all of our information right here, the trading stock section. We even have a software engineer that works with us. So if you guys are interested, definitely check it out. You won't regret it. Amazing stuff and spots are limited. All right, AMC Entertainment, we got some big news here. Because the options chain is absolutely exploding for June 18th. Like for all of you guys that have options expiring this week, Friday, raise your hand. I wanna see who you are. Because currently we are getting a ton of news about options, a game of squeezes, and huge amounts of buying specifically for this week. Like, let me give you guys an example. If I scroll all the way to the $145 strike price, there's nearly 42,000 of these contracts being opened and in people's brush accounts. And we're talking about an implied volatility of almost 600%. This is absolutely wild here. If we also check out other strike prices that are just a little bit in the money, like the $40 strike price, 100,000 of these contracts are open and held in people's brokerage accounts. By far the most popular AMC option and the whole entire AMC option chain. It's incredible here. Now, here's the thing. The price of AMC is at $50. So on expiration June 18th, if AMC is exactly at $50, all of these contracts here will be exercised. Remember this contract right here, the $40 strike price? If you guys have one of these calls, and it goes through expiration and they're like hey do you want to buy 100 shares of amc at 40 dollars a share and you look at the current share price and it's 50 bucks would you say no probably not you'll probably say yes so there you go that's a pretty big little gamma squeeze there you're kind of willing to buy a bunch of shares so the higher the price of amc goes the more of these options are eventually in the money. Let's say AMC goes to 70 bucks, okay? Everything under 70 bucks in all these contracts here, every single one of these people are gonna say yes and buy 100 shares at the select strike price. But they'll only do it if it's below the share price. So that's the power of a gamut squeeze. And you know what happens then, right? When you got a bunch of people buying AMC shares and most likely they're gonna hold it AMC is gonna go all the way up to the moon. Now, if you check out AMC right now and some of these options, it's insane. For this week, there's nearly a million call opens. You got 700,000 calls being open and 650,000 puts being open. Now, if we do a comparison of the other weeks, for example, like um, June 25th, it's a lot lower if you check this out. And you scroll all the way down, the contracts are extremely low and they're barely even visible. Like 100,000, that's it, 100,000 for each one. Now if you go even further out, like a random date, like you know next month, 23rd, it's also extremely low. At like a few thousand, and then maybe like 17,000 call options. And by the way, this looks really good for July here, that specific week. We do have way more people buying calls than puts at this moment, which means that majority of the people are getting pretty bullish. So there you go. That describes a lot of stuff. This is why this week is the most important because this week has the most amount of contracts being open. And I covered several times about this specific call contract, the $145 strike price. And what's super interesting about this is the volume is pretty decent, but the open interest is what's very, very unique because I covered this option two weeks ago because it struck me as very exciting. And when I covered it, it was only at 22,000 open interest. Now it's nearly twice that, 42,000 open interest. It's absolutely insane. When the market opens at 9.30 New York time, we have to see if this specific strike price goes up in the amount of contracts. 
If it goes up to like 50, 60, 70,000 today, then something is definitely up. I said this multiple times that that specific contract most likely have big money and hedge fund money in it. Remember, not all hedge funds are shorty AMC. In fact, a large majority of these hedge funds are actually buying more and more AMC, which makes things super interesting. Now, we also have some upcoming dates that everyone needs to know for AMC. And this also includes that we do have Henry Shorts, head of product intelligence at Kablo Global Markets, an absolutely big publicly exchanged company saying that AMC in the risk is not going down to 10, the risk is going up to $1,000. There you go, he straight up said it. And we could be seeing AMC hitting $1,000 very soon. If AMC, let's say, goes up to $50 and just stays there, we could be seeing a pretty good gamma squeeze. But if AMC closes this week at above 70 bucks, an even bigger gamma squeeze, and possibly a good amount of people covering in the free flow. Now, most likely not from the synthetic shares and naked shorting, but just simply from the free float, and that might actually send AMC to $100 this, this week. Now, we also have AMC perhaps joining the Russell 1000. I also want to stress that this is pretty big, and this is not just some sort of joke. Russell 1000 is a large cap stock, and it's heavily sought after by major investors. Their ETF, IWF, is also heavily sought after. And if AMC, GameStop, joins the Russell 1000, and is part of several of these major ETFs, guess what? The price of the stock will go up because when you buy one specific ETF that has these Russell 1000 stocks, you're also buying a small portion of AMC, which is huge. Now also, AMC Entertainment is doing some wild stuff this week, especially with a lot of retail traders getting pretty woke, retail traders are getting pretty excited, the overall market seemed pretty healthy, and therefore, a lot of retail traders want to get a small piece of AMC this week. Can I blame them? No, AMC is just such a phenomenal stock to play. And you guys need to check this out this week. As such how in the past month, AMC actually managed to stabilize from early June to mid-June. It's actually impressive. I know stabilization might not seem like a really exciting thing, but remember, if a stock doesn't stabilize, it's a trashy stock. In fact, I was worried that AMC might drop down back to 25 and stabilize there, that would be pretty bad. But no, AMC didn't do that. It did stabilize at a pretty fair price and it's now consolidating and doing its own AMC thing. So what do you guys think about AMC? I mean, we could be seeing a lot of big stuff coming in, a lot of big news. I mean, we already got a massive creating upgrade from the S&P Global. Really amazing stuff, a two notch upgrade from a triple C minus to a triple C plus. AMC is doing well, raising liquidity, acquiring other movie theaters, and try to get bigger and bigger as time goes on. That's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Definitely subscribe for more. And definitely check out the private Discord server, guys. You don't want to miss out. Link in the description below. And also check out BlockFi. Link in the description as well. Click on it, make a BlockFi account, so deposit some money, and get to $250 worth of Bitcoin. And plus, you can also earn interest from your coins just simply by holding it. Have a fun day and enjoy AMC.